The inverter is large and takes up quite a bit of real estate storage. Upon installation functions correctly out of the box unlike two others I have tried, the green one, first one which caught fire upon power up, second one upon a load of 100W. I have had this inverter on for approximately 48 hours and has performed great. So far only a very minor load under 200WA fan, simple safe alarm system, cell phone and laptop chargers. I installed this inverter along with Renogy, 4, 100A12V batteries and Epiver 40AM MPT, 2, 250W solar panels and TS30 transfer switch for my 33RV. This Renogy inverter unit is subject to 46 degrees Celsius during the day in the RV compartment so far heat has not been an issue. The only issue has been the remote I wanted to use with it, LCD, does not work with this unit RJ45 connection was needed and this does not have that, only a RJ11 standard phone type. The supplied remote does show if there are any faults, red LED and normal operation green LED, and on slash off switch. So glamour, but it does the job. This is the best inverter I found on the market. I have been living off the grid for a few years and have been through a number of inverters. This inverter is awesome it works everything I needed to do during the day it runs my video games by TV and other things I need to charge throughout the day and still have plenty of power when I turn on the generator. I'm surprised that the package cushioning only covered the two end pieces, no additional protective packing material. The AC and control end had been dented into the case a significant amount, plus a mounting brace for the internal PC board had one of its bolts sheared off. I took the unit apart and examined the insides, all seemed fine. I live on my sailboat in Central America, and it's not reasonable to obtain slash ship parts down here, so I occasionally have parts shipped to transit places in the US, so I can hand carry them on my return. In most cases, I don't have enough time to wait for an RMA and return item. I'm happy this worked out. My last inverter died after a direct lightning strike to my boat last summer, I really needed to get a sea power going again. Not sure yet about quiescent draw, but I'm very happy about how the fans are managed. My previous ones would turn the fans on during my refrigerator startup and stay on for a minute or so, but this unit's fan only turn on when it's hot, I imagine, as it takes a minute or so with a 100 amp load before the fan turns on, but not at all with the small refrigerator load. Thanks! I really like this Renogy 2012 Volt Watt Pure Sine Wave Inverter. The quality seems to be very good. I have used it for approximate 6 weeks and a 1000 plus miles of driving in my Ram Promaster conversion van. No errors have been thrown, unlike the Krieger 1500 Watt modified inverter that I have in my motorcycle trailer. Remote is handy and works great too. does what it is supposed to do. The wired remote works well and is easy to install. Looks professional. The voltage is stable and appears clean. Used in my RV solar install. Bad while there is a connector on the inverter for the remote, the cable is soldered into the remote itself. This forces you to route the cable in only one direction. Inverter pulls almost no power in true standby mode. Remote off, inverter pulls 15 watts when on and no load. There is no auto power down on no load, which can run a battery down. So far so good, I installed it an hour ago and it's been running my freezer effortlessly, can't wait to upgrade my charge controller to Renogy. Tried out the inverter and it is working well with a 5 amp drill. Multimeter says the inverter draws zero. 41 amps when powered on with no load. Hopefully it continues to be a long-lasting unit. 
click on the link below to see price.